very exciting as we were proceeding with this, this Corvette program downstairs because Mitchell would come in all the time just to see what was coming along with the models and, and encourage the, all of us to continue to you know, work on this particular theme. So now we were all back on this theme that I developed. When we got that thing all finished up, you know, he came in one day and, and looked at it and, you know, he's really liking it and he's talking to the model. He says, I want you to take and, and just give me a line right down the middle of the back window. So they went over and they, with a knife and ran a thing. He says, okay, now just imagine that we're going to split that apart and make two windows, one on either side there. And put a little wind split down there and right over the top and it's going to go to the front. So they did that and they modeled it in there and, and he was really liking it. So he's gone for a day or whatever. So Zora's coming over all the time looking at the thing and he's, you know, he was never really, really that excited about a front engine car. He worked for Porsche and, and he was very much for doing a mid-engine car. But again, he was, uh, even though he was always fighting the idea. He was still a team player and was trying to get the better engineering. I he walks in and he sees a split window on the back end and he says, what is this? He's looking at all the designers. Who did this? You know, and we explained that Mr. Mitchell had requested that we split the back window down. He says, this, this is so stupid. You know, he's it's going to cut down the visibility. It's you know it's a higher cost. It's you know he, he was just irate with the whole thing, and uh, he said you know we have to change this. This this has to go back the way you had this much better. The next day, <laughs> Mitchell comes in, and they have this giant screaming match over the over the rear window, and uh, and literally they're you know uh, Mitchell was could be very graphic in his conversation with people. <laughs> so anyway, the upshot is, is that he threw, threw Zora out of styling. He said, you're not coming back in here. This is my domain here, and we're going to build it this way and get the <coughs> out of here. And, uh, it, and it was, you know, we were aghast that, you know, these top management guys were screaming at each other about the way they were going to design our car. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, it, you know, looking back on it, it was pretty humorous, but you had to admire Bill Mitchell. He wasn't going to back down on anything. I just, I loved working for him. He was just such a fabulous guy to work for.